Emmy goes to Game of Thrones. <laughs> Game of Thrones still rules at the Emmys as it wins Best Drama a second year in a row. We're standing up here because uh, George Martin uh, created the world that we all now live and play in. We are standing up here because HBO, uh, Richard Plepler, Mike Lombardo have uh, graciously kept the lights on. And the Emmy goes to... And Veep repeats as Best Comedy. Veep! I'd also like to take this opportunity to personally apologize for the current political climate. Veep star Julia Louis-Dreyfus took Best Comedy Actress a record-breaking sixth time. She used the occasion to take a dig at presidential candidate Donald Trump. So I certainly do promise to rebuild that wall and make Mexico pay for it. Please give trans transgender talent a chance. Jeffrey Tambor won his second consecutive Best Comedy Actor Award for playing a transgender character in Transparent. Please tell me you're seeing this too. More of a surprise on the drama side where Rami Malek won Best Actor for Mr. Robot. I should have had this written down. And a shaken Tatiana Maslany took Best so Actress for um, Orphan Black. There's so many people I feel so indebted to. Um, the People versus O.J. Simpson. A big night for The People versus versus O.J. Simpson. It won Best Limited Series and Writing. It also earned awards for stars Sterling K. Brown and Sarah Paulson, who thanked the woman she played and her Emmy guest, Marsha Clark. Not the two-dimensional cardboard cutout I saw on the news, but the complicated, whip-smart, giant-hearted mother of two. And a win for Courtney B. Vance, who thanked his wife, Angela Bassett, and added... Obama! Politics was on a lot of people's minds. Jimmy Kimmel even opened the show with a bit with former GOP presidential candidate Jeb Bush, who's apparently looking for work. You know you can make $12 an hour driving for Uber? Laurie Neff, The Associated Press. But that's great. I have to get downtown to the Emmys.